Wildfire science has been around for more than 50 years, but that science comes from pretty limited data. Here we are in 2024, where we have almost limitless data out there. So now we just need to update a lot of these older models. That's where machine learning can really help. Our tool, Wintel, is an ember spread modeling software that is to be used in the field during an active wildfire. Embers are very dangerous because about 90% of houses that burn in wildfires are actually caused by these embers. And Gemini is helping us scour the web for all historical fires that have happened. We can collect them into database and just look at certain variables that we're interested in studying to inform our machine learning models and help us learn how future fires will behave. The ultimate goal of machine learning is to make reliable predictions. In our own workflow, we're using machine learning to help estimate probability of ignition, depending on all the weather conditions, all the topographical conditions. And if we can better model the winds, we can estimate better how the fire is going to behave on the ground and also how those, those embers are gonna travel through the air. Running predictions demands more computational power. With Google Kubernetes Engine, we could run thousands of instances on Google Cloud and provide our users in the field near real-time predictions. One of the very first fires that we studied with the Ember Spread model was the South Fork fire near Roidoso, New Mexico. Every single time that we made an Ember Spread prediction, we very well predicted not only where the embers would land, but also the general direction and movement of the fire. At that point, our end user was literally speechless, and so were we.